Hey guys, I'm Giovanni Herbert. Welcome to SnapComs, where we bring you news in a snap. Our guest today is the Deputy Managing Director of Corporate Services at the Financial Services Commission, FSC, Mrs. Jennifer Pata Kittels, and she'll be informing us of the upcoming FinTech Conference on Monday, July 23rd and Tuesday, July 24th at the H. Laverty Stout Community College. Thank you for joining us, Mrs. Pata Kittels. Hi, Mr. Herbert. Thank you for having me. There's a much talked about event, conference coming up, FinTech. There's so much buzz going on about this as the territory hosts it on July 23rd and 24th at the college. Uh, what is it about and what is its significance to the territory? Well, technology is drastically impacting the financial industry. But it's not just the industry, it's the job market, it's the economy in general, it's policy development, it's legislative changes. There are a number of changes in these areas, there are lots of opportunities. Um, simply, this conference is about preparation and opportunity. Preparation and opportunity, and um, who is the audience that will have the opportunities uh, that we are targeting for this conference here in the BVI? And what can they expect in their participation of the conference? Well, we'd like to see a very diverse audience. We think there's a lot in the conference for a number of segments in the economy. Certainly in the financial services industry, we'd like to see practitioners there. We'd like to see academics and educators. We'd like to see entrepreneurs and potential entrepreneurs, um, small businesses, Everybody has something to gain from understanding what's happening with digital disruption and how fintech is affecting how business grows and develops. So clarify for me what you would like the target audience to pull away from this or know with regards to this conference. Well, going into the conference, what I want people to take away is that fintech is here. It's not an abstract coming soon concept. It's not the future. It's here. It's here already. We see the effects in banking, we see the effects in hospitality, and what's important for people to understand is that finance and fintech is not simply for financial professionals anymore, and it's not only for techies. It's an opportunity for all of us in the BVI to understand how we can position, participate, and profit from digital disruption and a new economy. Uh, how do you see this conference positively contributing in enhancing the financial services industry as it relates to all of these occupations and descriptions? Well, I think financial services is front and center in digital disruption. Um, our clients are global, so we can't afford not to be. And if we are producing and providing 1980 products and services, that doesn't work in 2018. If we are not able to pivot, to change our outlook, to take advantage of the opportunities will go the way of the VCR. Mm, the way of the VCR. Thank you so much, Mrs. Pata Kittels. Thank you for having me, and I hope everybody is psyched to come out and see the event. It's a wonderful opportunity to hear from a subject matter expert. The facilitator is based in Singapore, and we know Singapore to be a world leader both in finance and in innovation. So it's going to be a great opportunity for people who are pivoting, thinking about pivoting, or need to pivot, this is where you want to be next week. And on that note, here's a message from Associate Professor Keith Carter. I'm so happy to be coming over to the British Virgin Islands to talk about the new economy. An economy where new jobs will be created more, in fact, than ever before. And also an economy where business leaders, business owners, people who are thinking about doing business and entrepreneurs have more opportunity to experiment, to try, and to succeed than ever before as well. I'll be talking about fintech, AI, blockchain, cloud, and data, and how all of them can be used to make game-changing differences, not only in business, but in lives and in government. That's it for today, guys. I'm Giovanni Herbert signing off. Be sure to tune in for your daily feed of Snapcoms, where we bring you news in a snap. 
Subscribe to our YouTube channel, Twitter, and Facebook at BVI Government and Instagram at GIS BVI. SNAPCOMS is brought to you by the Disaster Recovery Coordinating Committee, Government of the Virgin Islands.